All right, so this is how I drain my tank. I got my net set up here, it's draining out through that pipe. And this is what is inside of my uh, tank here. You can see there's uh, some leaves that haven't broken down yet. I just put them in a couple days ago. And it's all mixed in with some other crap uh, in various states of decay, basically. And uh, there's like a, a brownish muck that forms. And uh, I believe that this is uh, the remains of the cellulose. Uh, and also um, uh, the biofilm or bioflock or whatever they call it that uh, that forms it's kind of the uh, bacterial the bacteria get together and on the surface of what they're breaking down and they kind of form like a webbing so that's kind of it uh, I'm getting near the bottom of the tank so I'm sucking up all kind of sludge there at the bottom but we still got water coming draining out and uh, it doesn't smell anaerobic or hydrogen sulfide or methane or anything like that. It's just uh, gnarly looking water. But I think it's because of all the... Um, solids that are the remainder of being digested or they were partially digested. Not exactly sure, frankly. But I think that's what murks it up. If you look close, you can see deeper than the surface of the water, there's also some crap floating in the water. Hard to see. Alright, well there it is in all of its glory. And it uh, looks like uh, we're just about done draining, so I'll just push this net around a few times so it drains off the water and I'll put the solids back in there it all goes back in there when I trim plants or um, I've got potting soil or anything I put it in there and uh, a couple days anaerobic a couple days aerobic let it sit for an hour and then drain off the good stuff and this is the good stuff so hopefully that works out <laughs>